Your relationship with Stanley Kubrick, he became an acquaintance when you were essentially playing uh, sports as teenagers. Um, yeah, yeah. Th that's basically it. Could you speak a little bit about that, how, how that came about and how that transitioned to actually working together for five movies? We had a mutual friend, Alexander Singer, who Kubrick used as a assistant to the director who has directed his own pictures. And uh, he brought us together. Uh, Kubrick was looking for a composer for his shorts and uh, Alex said, well, talk to Jerry Fried, I mean, et cetera. So he did and I, that was my first picture. Uh, it was a short, an 18 minute short, about a, a day in the life of a fighter. And uh, we were working together for the next four movies. I think you had mentioned it in another interview that he, he became, I suppose, more confident as he, he went along. Uh, you mentioned that in the first short, you could pretty much do, score it how you wanted. Mm -hmm. And by the time you got to Paths of Glory, he was a little bit more sort of, I guess, hands-on or more involved in, in your score. Speak I, about I, how that changed. I had to justify every note I wrote to him. Every which, note. Uh, accounts perhaps for his success. He, he took care of all kinds of details, including the score. He himself uh, played drums in his high school office, so he had some connection with music. What, what were the arguments about uh, or the discussions about? Um, would, would he... Would he would he make references to other scores or, or how, what sort of conversations would you have? Let me try to remember. I think uh, he uh, wanted to make sure that my primary interest wasn't to uh, show off my music, but to make the picture a better movie. So I think he was monitoring to make sure that I understood what each scene was about. And we had some arguments about that, as I remember. Uh, you know, I, I interpreted my way, and he, of course, interpreted his way as well as making the movie. But we stayed friends, pretty much. Mm -hmm. And um, and I, I actually wonder about the... Um, did you ever go go back? Did you did you, did you ever plan on perhaps uh, reconnecting with another film down the line? Did you have conversations after Paths of Glory about maybe doing something else together? Well, uh, I called him uh, when I found out he was doing Spartacus, his next movie after Paths of Glory, and uh, he said, uh, "Well, uh, he didn't want to tell me." So I said, "You talk to Kirk Douglas." which I did. And Kirk said, Jerry, you're just not experienced enough. So I, I could not get on that movie. And then Stanley and I didn't talk much after then. He was caught up in the industry and uh, I wasn't a big name. You know, he had Alex North and Davici Tiampian and Max Steiner and all those guys. Uh, so I was just you know, a kid. So I didn't work with him again. <laughs> 